The Chinese demand for traditional medicines has sent poachers hunting for African animals, from rhinos to pangolins. Now a hobbler creature is threatened, donkeys. Once prized by emperor's uh, guillotine called a jar made uh, from donkey skins is increasingly sought after by China's middle class. The New Central's Bettina Mueli has more on this fascinating but disturbing story. A recent study by researchers from the University of South Africa showed the donkey population shrank from 210,000 in 1996 to about 146,000 in 2019. The shrinking supply has sent prices soaring. Sources say a donkey would fetch about $30 at auction five years ago. Now, they cost about $125 each. That is still a relative bargain in China where donkey hides that sold for $473 in 2018 now sell for $1,160. The ajia will produce from them can sell for up to $360 per kilogram. Okay, in South Africa, we've seen a rapid decline of the donkey population due to illegal slaughter um, to supply the Chinese skin trade. Um, it is believed that in China, if you eat the donkey skin that's boiled in a certain way, it, it um, has certain health benefits, very similar to what they believe um, health benefits that are found in rhino horn. The health benefits from donkeys are believed similar to products derived from rhino horns, from working as a blood thinner to acting as an aphrodisiac, which could ease pressure on endangered rhinos. But as in countries from Burkina Faso to Kenya, South Africa is now seeing its donkey population plunge, yeah. threatening <laughs> other businesses that make soap and creams from donkey meal. The product that they actually make from the, the donkey skin is called Ejao, and it is definitely a more upmarket type of product which is found in China. Um, as far as we know and research that is out there, there's no scientific backing behind Ejao from a medical perspective about the, um, the benefits of it. So it is obviously a very traditional type of medicine. Kenya banned donkey slaughter in 2020 after the population there plunged due to the skin trade. Donkey milk is believed to contain antioxidant, antimicrobial and anti-diabetic properties. South Africa has two donkey That's dairies, correct, but they may not be viable if prices for the animals keep rising. Yeah. Bettina Nwili for New Central TV.